giant Godo moment. Fwahaha! I am Kogo of the Leap 4. I live in shadows and I live in shadows, a ninja. My in my intrigue my intrigues my intrigue my intrigue uh, I have a bad reading of you can just tell. Style will confound and destroy you. Confusion sleep poison. Prepare for the to be a victim of my sinister technique. Fwaha. Pokemon are merely about brute voice. I shall s you shall see soon enough. Okay, so that wasn't my best reading, but I've had better. Here's Koga. He was actually um the sixth gym leader in Pokemon Gold no not gold. Pokemon Red, Blue and Yellow and in Fire Lane Green. But now in the second generation he's uh he's just a Oh, a will be member in Gold, Silver, and Crystal. And High Gold and Soul Silver. Yeah. Hi, gotta love that second gen. So he starts off with an area dose, level 40. I'm gonna nail a fire punch at it, and it should one and kill it. It should. Let's see. There we go. Okay. There goes the area dose. Now, keep in mind, one of his Pokemon is Fortress, and I might be coming out next, surprisingly. Yeah, he's gonna send out Fortress, and the thing is, it's Bug and Steel type, I believe. So it's four times weak to, it's four times weak to Fire type move. So it's a bad choice to put it when I still my Flint in battle, but I guess not. I can't complain. This should definitely want to kill it, even though it's level 43. It still should want to kill it. Let's see if I'm right. Uh, there we go. It does have high defenses though, so I just recommend a Fire type to put to sleep. So, that'd be nice, or to faint in that matter. Because, um, a little less experience than you thought it should, though. Muck, okay. Thing is, we're going to go to... Queen. Yeah, we're gonna go Queen. And Queen has Earthquake, which is the same type of attack boss, too, so that's why I used Queen's Earthquake instead of Flint's Earthquake, because it gets the same type of attack boss. Muck isn't that bad. I just really recommend either a psychic type, a move like psychic or side beam, or an earthquake move. No, I want an earthquake move, a ground type move like earthquake. Because you do have the TM. I showed that in a bonus video on how to get it. Because I totally forgot about it. But it was in, it was in a bonus video. It's not an actual part because that was too short of footage. So that's why I didn't make it for part. That one he KO'd it. Find a moth. Okay, we're gonna go back to Flint. So let's do that. Venom Moth is, um, Bug and Flying type, so, yeah, I believe so. So it's four times weak to Rock, so if you have a Rock type move, like Rock Throw, Rock Hard, you're in, you're good in good shape. I'm gonna use Fire Punch on this thing. This should want to KO this Venom Moth, so let's see. There we go. 12-12, I like that. Cool bet, huh? You know what, I'm gonna actually challenge myself with the flint. I'm gonna use, I'm going to use Thunder Punch on it. See, because I practiced a lot in the cold bats in Victory Road. I think I can take the Nocrow Battle one here with this Thunder Punch. I think I can. I'm pretty sure. Oh man. Maybe I did go to Sean and practice one. Okay. Okay, I see how it is. Shit. Oh, I can use a full story. Okay. I'll burn that cuts its attack. Let's just use that fire punch. Let's use a flame wheel actually. Let's give a flame wheel. Let's give a flame wheel on that. Yeah, there we go. This should win it. This should KO it. There we go, nice. Okay. Level 51, nice. And Koko was defeated. Moving yourself forth. Forty thousand four hundred poker dollars worth of words. Send some to mom. Okay. I subjected you to everything I could I could ma I could muster. But my efforts failed. I must hone my skills. Go on to the next room and put your abilities to the test. So with that said, we're gonna go on to the next room but first